What the hell was that? I don't know what the fuck that was. Let's go. Things had gone Shit. from fine to fucked up in about a second, and now there were two idiots at the wheel. Clear. Got the floor? Sure. Look after yourself, bro. Stay safe. It wasn't my own safety I was concerned about, trophy wife or not. I'd said I would protect the girl. I hoped I hadn't lost my edge, along with everything else. That was the boss lady. Only this time she wasn't calling for more liquor in her cocktail. It might have been stupidity, or drunkenness, or maybe both. But before I knew it, I was back taking insane risks, trying to save fallen women. Tranquila! Tranquila! Nós cuidamos disso! Nice work! Now you need a hand? No, you? Where the hell's Rodrigo? Yeah, I don't know, man. Thanks. Somebody's gotta go find him. Está tudo sob controle agora. Fica tranquilo. I imagine the elevator door is opening to a firing squad of muzzles. As far as I could see it, the one thing my plan had going was that no one else would be stupid enough to pull this move. Where is he? Once Bronco was out the door, all bets were off. I had to keep moving. It looked like they were taking him out through the basement. Maybe I still had a shot. Rodrigo was too rich a prize for them to throw away. Sure, I'd have to work hard to get him back, but I knew the bad guys would want the boss alive almost as much as I did. was on the wall to the left of the gate. The great thing about being famous as well as rich is the bad guys know who to kidnap. I'd done them enough favors. I didn't need to give them more of a head start. Stay down! 
Browns, Mr. Bronco! Mr. Bronco! You're okay. You're okay. Yeah. Come on, get up. Come on, get up. You're okay. Come with me. Just come on. It's okay. <laughs>